Hello guys, welcome back to the next episode of City Skylines with me, Biffa. Here we are by the monument that normally has my face on it, on the thumbnails. I like this. <laughs> the Statue of Industry that people come to see. So, what are we working on today? Well, I've done a bit of work over the weekend. We've been struggling with traffic coming into the area here. We added this hyperspace bypass, didn't we? So people coming in here can go straight over the top if they want to come down to this new area because a lot of people were queuing to come through the main entrance but they wanted to come down to this new area down here. We have lots of residents and of course people are queuing to get down here as well which is causing a problem that needs to be sorted. And also here, this is a queue that's getting worse because junctions are hitting each other, they're queuing here. This industry area they're trying to get into. Down here, they seem to just want to stop all the time. Um, for no reason. Look, this, this car could go. He could go, because nothing's happening. He could go, for sure. Look, what's stopping him? But every time they get here, they stop and they think. And I don't know why and what's going on. So, what I did is I tore out this. Oh, and of course, we had this little mess over here <laughs> that I needed to sort. This junction's okay. Nobody goes up here, funnily enough. I don't know why. <laughs> yes, of course I do. But, um, yes, this needs to sorting out as well. So, I did a bit of playing around. And rather than do it on camera, I wanted to make sure it was all all okay. And not too much fiddling for you guys to watch. So, let me load up the save game with that on. Let's zoom out here. There we go. And we can take a look at what I've done and see how much of a difference, hopefully, fingers crossed, that it's made. So let me just load that up. And here we go. Here's the new look city, the new entrances and exits and all that sort of thing. And just before we look at those, just wanted to cover one little thing that uh, you guys have been asking me. You guys have been saying you want more episodes of City Skylines. You've been enjoying it so much. Well, I'm absolutely loving making it as well. So what I was thinking is let's do something to help each other out. You want more episodes, how about if you get this episode up to 500 likes, which is more than likes they've been getting so far, They're getting lots of views, but um, people were forgetting to hit that like button, and I think a reminder goes a long way, which my Hermitcraft episodes have proved. If I just remind people, people are always willing to help out with a like. Oh, do you have a fire down here? Has that gone out? Oh, it's gone out, it's fine. So if we get this up to 500 likes, then I will re release a second episode today of City Skyline. So I'm going to be working hard to get those recorded for you. And if you can help me out with the likes, I can help you out with more content. How about that for a deal? Well, let's see what I've been doing here. So I added this little interchange in here, this roundabout, just to help things move along here. This will eventually be expanded, of course. But this was clogging up a little bit, so that's helped. And the industry needs built up, so Biff Ore is doing well. We will add some more stuff over here. So we have some more ore that we can we can make use of. So there's that. Here I've added in what's this one called? This is the one, isn't it? The diverging diamond interchange, which is really good. Anybody that's coming off and wanting to turn left gets a free left turn. So if they want to go that way, they come off, turn left. If they're coming this way, left, 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 get into the city. It's a really nice working interface. Things move very smoothly. You still you still have some stoplights. But generally speaking, it's a pretty good interchange. And then that's gone down to another little roundabout here. Just to help people get into the this section here, Bifoil, from the other direction. So just a little roundabout and an on and off ramp. And that's been working quite well too. I've, I've put this here because we can start expanding our industry around that. We have the same interchange coming in and out here. Notice, no tailbacks anymore along here, which is good. We'll come to this section down here in a moment. I then have, of course, the hyperspace bypass we had last time, the on and off for that, so people can get straight down to this area if they want to. Slightly change this here. This exit now comes all the way around to the roundabout here, just to split the traffic, because it was merging with this coming in from this side, and it was just clogging up everything here, because most people are wanting to go down here, some are going up here, but I've split it, and that seems to work a lot better. And then also to help people come into this industry area, I put a couple of little off ramps here, which merge, but that's okay, coming into this side. And that's been working well. Finished emptying. Okay, let's open that up. What's that one there? Building is emptying, 31%. I've been told I don't need all these landfill sites. Once I get incinerators, um, let's just empty that one. The incinerators take over, so we'll work on that another time. But yeah, and that's been working that's been working quite well. We no longer have look at that. This is running 
traffic free now no more tailbacks this little bit here is still sort of clogged up but it's moving um, it's mainly people wanting to get back onto the highway again from here it's funny because they're not taking this route they will always come up here I could add another little road somewhere I don't know we'll see we'll see how that goes but this is working okay this little roundabout hill allergies or something today let me have a quick sip of water this is working okay here which is good so we're pleased with that so that's just a few little changes that have worked out well I think that's going okay so let's check how everything is doing electricity availability not too bad but we're going to be expanding so I'm going to add another one of these in get another 20 megawatts just to beef that up a bit which will be good there we go water availability everybody's okay oh something else I want you guys to do I want you to give me some names we have Biffor and Biffoyle they're going to stay lower Bifton and Bifton Heights but as we expand Forest of Biffa that, that could change um, as we expand we could we could name things we could name interchanges because I can set a district around this and we could name that we could name this here we could name all sorts of things and I want you guys to suggest names to me. The Statue of Industry, that can be named. Hospitals, fire stations, anything in the game can be named. So I want you guys to let me know some really funny sort of names based on puns. You know, things that would make you chuckle. This is building up nicely. I like this area here. So let me know what you think. Uh, and we can start working on getting some cool names into here. And I mentioned the person that gives me the name as well. And uh, yeah, that's the plan. So let me do, let me, let you, put my teeth back in. You do that. Let me name the things and we'll be, be covering that in the next episode. Uh, it might take a couple of episodes once you start getting the names in because I do tend to record a couple of heads. But as soon as you give me the names, as soon as I can, I'll start getting them in. Um, this is working okay. Draining. I want it to clear up all of this if possible, because at one point we will start getting this area, but yeah, we shall see. Right, let me just take a look over here <clears throat> before we check other things. So we've got oil. That's not getting coal. And that's got coal for 14 weeks. I'm just wondering whether, let's turn that on, whether that's not enough fuel because... I've had it turned off. Let's leave it on for a bit <clears throat> and see what happens. So I wanted to check here. So electricity is fine. Water availability will be going down soon. So what I'm going to do is add another one of these in. There we go. Just to make sure we don't expand and it suddenly becomes a problem. There we go. So that will pick up. Garbage is becoming a problem. Let's have a look. Landfill usage, incineration status. So we need more incinerators. I want to start replacing these landfill sites. That one's emptying. Can I just delete those and put in more incinerators? This is 62% full. Building is not empty. No, I can't. Well, they're emptying, so we'll let those empty. And then we will replace those. But these people aren't happy over there. We have this incinerator. Oh, we have a landfill site here. And, you know, the incinerator here is working well. I wonder, if we just empty that and see how that goes. Oh, we have a fire. Are they dealing with it? They are dealing with it. Going through the park cars. Good, good, good. What is that? An iron forge. Okay. Nothing that won't be replaced. So we can deal with that. Healthcare capacity is good. Average health is 64%. So we're not huge on the old... Is this showing all the medical facilities? It is. So, oh, hey, hang on. That's now... Oh, it does switch and change. So we have those there. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay, hospitals. So we don't have anything up here. And we don't have anything over here. I'm wondering whether just to put... medical place over here as well this side of the roundabout because they just tend to want to have to travel all the way along where would be a good spot for that without destroying too much industry there we go we'll stick that one there 
Crematoriums we have either end of the city. We won't worry about those. Let's have a look. Fire safety. What have we got? We've got one here, one couple there, one there. We have some up here as well, so we're okay for that. What's that building? That's something new. Standard fire station. We should have two of those. Yeah, these assets. Waiting for those to get fixed. <laughs> okay, hazard is high here. Hmm. Maybe need another little something over this way. I think that would be a good idea. Um, maybe stick a firehouse down here. Yeah, I think that would be a good idea. There we go. Increase all of that, hopefully, slightly. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Hazards dropping, hazards dropping. It doesn't really cover a huge area, does it, these things? I think as we expand more, we will get a firehouse in, but not just at the moment. Police crime rate is extremely low, so we're not going to worry about that. Schools, now this is something I want to check. Elementary school capacity. Eligible, right, oh, we need more elementary schools. Okay, so what ones have we got? That's an elementary school. That's an elementary school. Is that only showing me elementary schools? Yes, it is. Okay, that's good. Let's zoom out. So we've got one there, one there, one there. We could do with one over here, I think. That sort of spreads it out a bit. So maybe we can stick... Let's have a look. One just there. That's good. So that will beef up the capacity, hopefully. There we go. Just about over the top. High school capacity, we need a lot more. We've got one there, one there. Again, we need one over this way somewhere. Let's squeeze that in. On the corner. I want to take a minimal amount of buildings as possible. There we go. Hopefully that's enough. Let's just wait for that to kick in. Still need another high school. Okay. What's this building here? University. Let's see if we can stick one in the middle here. How much is that costing me? 24,000. We have the money. Building must be placed roadside. There we go. What is that I was trying to replace there? The Robin residence. Well, whoever... Oh, I see. It's the Metro. Okay, that's fine. Let's see how that's done. Excellent. Capacity is up. University. But see, university is that old university. What does that look like? And a new university. University... Eligible 2,000. Plenty of spaces for universities. I think we have one somewhere. We do. Here we go. Have our new university. Operating normally. Excellent. Mm, bus routes. Metros. We added our metro system in last time. And what's that saying here? Let's have a look. 1,777 per week. We don't have a bus route yet. So we're going to be doing that soon. Oh, let's go back to that. Let's just click... Can I just click on one of these? I don't want to add a tunnel. I want to just get some facts and figures about this. It's running both ways. See, I was thinking about changing my stops around. I'm not sure. I'm not going to do that right now. But I've got them running all clockwise. I was going to add another one going anti-clockwise around this main ring. In fact, we could do that now. That's not going to take long, is it? Let's just let's just run round here. If we have one going both directions, there we go, on there, and we'll do the same here as well. Let's start here, so we'll go to there, so you have one clockwise and one anti-clockwise, then you're covering the way each person wants to go, hopefully. Let's do the same here, we'll start there, Now we've still got our crossover point, so if people want to change and get onto the next line, there we go, complete line. So that's covered most of our city. I mean, some people are having to walk a bit further, but that's okay. Bus routes we'll get to. I do want to do bus routes. I haven't quite got to that yet. So that's our transport covered. So we're doing okay. Still no idea why these are all unlocked. Apparently they shouldn't be, but for some reason they are. So, very strange. We can add some of those in as and when we go. So what do we need? We need some more residential, commercial and industry. We need some of everything. So what I'm going to do is actually add <clears throat> a 
Let's add some normal industrial zones over here. We have a couple of spots that we can sort of fill in. Let's use the fill tool. And we'll get all of these filled in. I think that should be everything. Apparently we have a new building. Yep, I know about that. Thank you. Is there anything else over there that we could do? There isn't. Some of these areas here... This may end up going. We shall see. Possibly it may end up going. We will check that. Building is emptying, still emptying, still emptying. Okay. And move all our industry up this way. Possibly. We shall see. Let's have a look at the oil. So we still have more oil we could do. So let's add... Let's add some one-way roads coming out of here, around this area. How close can we get? We come out to here. Cross two. Nope. And down. I think that would be good. There we go just fill this up. We may not use it all at once. Ah, what's that going through? Let's move. Move the firehouse. That's going to go there. Everybody's happy again. Might as well finish marking out this. Hang on a second. Have I done that right? That one's going up. That one's going down, that one's going up, that one's going down, that one's going up. Uh, no, this one needs to go down. I don't think I've done that right. Let's take those out. Have I done these other ones right? I'm getting confused now. Let's have another look. So what have we got? We've got up, down, up, down. Yeah. So this needs to go up. But that was up, wasn't it? Mm, my brain hurts. Oh, there we go. Okay, yep. Yeah, so it needs a way to get out. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, right. And let's just fill all of this in with industry. How much do we need? We don't need a huge amount of industry, so maybe let's just do that. And let's just check this is all part of the Biff Oil. There we go. This is all going to be Biff Oil. There we go. Oh, people are out, out of water over here. Good call. Thank you for telling me. Let's cover that. And the same here. Let's go over a bit. One. Oh, one more. Let's hook onto that. Or we'll just go like that. There we go. Everyone's got water. Good, good. So that's industry will start building in there. There we go. Yep, coming in already. Excellent. And more residential. I know you guys have been loving my residential design over here. What's the matter with you guys? Garbage is piled up. Garbage is piled up. Incineration status. Yeah, the incinerators are a bit on the slow side. I do need a couple more. Are they still emptying? 14%, 59%. I'm going to add another incinerator over here anyway. It's most already occupied. What's the closest I can get it? There we go. Let's add that. Hopefully that will assist. And let's get some more roundabouts going over here. We have this nice little area. Buy new land available for purchase. Oh, wow. We have lots. Some of you may have seen I put out a video talking about how you can unlock all 25 squares now. And that will work on any map. If you just look at my video. Um, hopefully I'll remember to put a link in it. But if you just search for unlock all 25 squares, I'm the only person who's put out a video on that at the moment. And uh, Or look on my channel. Instead of just having 9 out of the available 25, you could actually have all 25. So, that is exciting stuff. 
<clears throat> Let us go for some small small roundabouts. Is it small roundabouts we've been using? Yes. Yes, it is. Right, okay. Just want to make sure we're using the right, right thing. Let's angle these around a bit. Make it interesting. So let's have one there. We can sort of hook up into here, can't we? If we get the angle right on that. One there. Let's have another one. Another one there. That looks good. And then let's just work out how these are all going to connect together. Oh, abandoned building. Goodbye. Let's put on the hooky thing. If we go this way. There we go. And do that one to there. That makes it interesting, doesn't it? We could have this one to come in. Well, you don't want it taking out three buildings. Go into there. To there. That is a freaky deaky corner. Let's delete that. There we go. That's better. Then we can have this one connect into here. Not so far out. There we go. This can connect up over here. What do we have here? Just some nice houses. Well, they're going to get a surprise because the higher the hyperspace bypass, the road is coming through. Uh, we could just kind of bang in the middle, couldn't we? Let's go there and there. Sorry, you're unhappy. In fact, that was a bit too bendy. Let's make that look a bit nicer. There we go. Good, good. And then this one can go to here. And again, I'm going to take this out. Just so it doesn't look so freaky deaky. In fact, I'm going to take that out as well. And we're going to join them up together much better. Let's go. There we go. Like that. And we'll leave. <clears throat> Should we do the middle one here? Yeah, let's do the middle one here as well. Let's take those out. And we will go like that and around like that. Excellent. There we go. Let's fill this in. Get this all nicely industrialised. Not industrialised. What were these ones here? These were these, weren't they, I think? Yeah. And then I'm just thinking whether to have more of a high... High density residential over here, like that side. I think so. Yep, let's go for that. So let's just cover all of that with that. And that there. Any that we've missed. People are moving in already. That's good. And then this was here, wasn't it? Nope, this one. Let's right click to D zone, left click to zone. There we go. Good, good, good. And then we want to just maybe add... Let's just have a look at our coverage again for our healthcare. Yeah, let's have a little healthcare building in here. Keep those guys happy. Fire station, we've got some nearby. Police we're not worried about. Schools we've looked at. So I think that should be okay for them. Keep them happy there. Let's just check our metro. We don't have a metro line over here. Let's add in... A metro station. <clears throat> this is where it starts getting interesting, trying to add these after the fact. Mm. Electricity and water. Caught me out there, sipping my tea. Water. Let's get... Let's get plenty of water coverage here. Make sure they're all okay. Yep. Is that some there? Oh, there's some... There we go. Electricity. Eventually you will get some. As people move in. Just thinking maybe let's run. Let's do that for now. 
just until everybody gets some. And that'll be good. And then in the middle of these roundabouts... We were actually zoning them differently, weren't we? Yes, we were. What were we putting in there? Commercial. So let's just dezone these and go with our plan that we've been doing. There we go. Which is commercial stuff. Oh, don't want to. Could I just do it like that? That would be easier. There we go. That one, that one, that one. That was it, wasn't it? And then we can put in high-density commercial. Is that what we've been adding? Possibly. We've got high-density residential, so let's add that. Yes, it is. There we go. We want this to be a destination. People want to come and visit. And then, why are you still saying you've not got enough water? Why is that pipe not connected? Ah, that's why. Good, it's not connected. <clears throat> People are upgrading. And then let's stick a park or two. I see park. We've got some new ones here that have been added in. Park Plaza by... I don't know what some of these... What's that one there? Inconspicuous Alley. <laughs> no idea what that is. Construction cost... 516 a week. They're all about the same. Parcacino. It's a shame we haven't got these pictures yet and what they can look like. Well, let's just pick one. Let's scroll along. What's this one here? Picnic Park. 400. That sounds good. Let's add a park. Space already occupied. There we go. One there. Yep, that's cheered people up. The leisure is pretty low. Accessibility to leisure is low for a lot of these areas. Yeah, let's have a small playground as well. We'll do that this side. Try and cover as much as possible. Yeah, we're going to expand a bit more that way, so that'll be good. And what are you unhappy about? Not enough educated workers. Well, education is something that is going okay, so... Maybe that will build up. Ah, <clears throat> oh, there we go. Industry's moved in. Excellent. And they're complaining not enough workers. <laughs> oh, man. We have people moving in. We have workers. They're coming. Don't you worry, guys. Well, I think we're going to have to end that episode here. Don't forget, if you want to see another episode today, then to get this video up to 500 likes, and I will gladly release... Oh, dear. It's more abandoned buildings. I will gladly release the next episode for you later on today so hopefully our workers are going to start coming in we need some we need some more please come on workers move in but i think we're doing okay don't forget as well any comments any help that you have that is always appreciated leave that below 95% full 9% full so nearly empty that's good we're getting there with those let's just check this one here 49%. We're going to get these incinerators going. That's what we need. So, I will see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.